Hello, my name is Eric, administrator for Driftless Wisconsin, which represents Crawford County, Vernon County, and the Kicking Valley uh, in the southwest portion of, uh, of Wisconsin, which is the very heart of the Driftless area. If you've not heard of the word Driftless before, uh, or maybe you've heard it and don't quite understand what it means, drift is the sediment left behind by glaciers. So we are driftless. And what we do have here, though, is spectacular scenery. Because we were never flattened by the glaciers um, during the glacial period, uh, we have these tall, towering bluffs overlooking river valleys, and we have deep, secluded valleys, uh, which are a lot of fun to explore. We are a mecca for outdoor recreation. We've got uh, hiking, biking, canoeing, kayaking, birding, just about anything that you want to do outdoors, we have right here in Driftless, Wisconsin. We have three major rivers here in Driftless, Wisconsin. We've got wild, uh, we've got uh, the Mississippi, which is just to my left here. Uh, great for uh, boating and uh, sport fishing. Uh, just a wonderful time being out in the river and being between the two bluffs, the Iowa Bluffs and the Wisconsin Bluffs. And it's just truly a, a scenic river to be on. And we have the Wisconsin River to our south. And uh, that features uh, canoeing and kayaking and fishing as well. And then meandering down the middle of Driftless, Wisconsin, we've got the Kickapoo River, which is often called the crookedest river in the world. Uh, it's a river that with a lot of twists and bends, and every time you're on the river, every time you come around the bend, uh, you've got a new scene. It's just a really quite uh, scenic. And then feeding all these rivers are small trout streams that come into the Kickapoo, come into the Mississippi, and they feature some absolutely world-class uh, fly fishing. We have three parks, three state parks in the area. We've got Wyalusing State Park at the confluence of the Wisconsin and Mississippi River, just south of Pertichee. Uh, up along the Kickapoo River, we've got Wildcat, Wildcat Mountain uh, State Park uh, up in Ontario overlooking the Kickapoo. And right along the Kickapoo, uh, we also have the Kickapoo Valley Reserve. And all of these parks have miles and miles of hiking. A lot of these hiking trails are, are right along the river, overlooking the river. And you can imagine uh, camping in one of these parks and uh, opening up your tent flap in the morning and looking out and seeing a, a sunrise over the river valley. It's, it's, uh, it's quite unique. And uh, these, these hills in this area are perfect uh, for biking. Uh, they're challenging. Uh, it takes a little effort to get to the top. Why, once you get to the top, they are uh, you have a spectacular view. If you don't like outdoor recreation, uh, looking for more things uh, indoors, uh, we have some uh, wonderful shopping in the area. Uh, small town shops with uh, big time in hospitality. We've got three wineries uh, in the area. Uh, we've got indoor water parks if you're looking to be in the water but uh, out of the sun. And we've got uh, outdoor with uh, miniature golf and go karts. And we have a, a very vibrant art scene here. You can imagine this scenery and how inspiring it is to local artists. They produce some truly unique artwork in this area. So I invite you to come to Driftless, Wisconsin to experience all that we have outdoors and so much more.